Our aim is to make virtual reality more human. If you've ever sort of um, had the chance to put on a virtual reality headset, it gives you a sense that you're somewhere else, and that's really great, but can often feel lonely because there aren't other people there with you. Um, and you can, can kind of work with that by having uh, CGI characters, but then you have to um, face the uncanny valley effect. So the way that we're dealing with is putting like real video, volumetric video of humans into VR. We deal with a number of challenges. The first is the reconstruction challenge. So taking um, video streams from a lot of different off-the-shelf cameras around that person that's doing their performance and bring those all together in coherent volumetric video. And that requires working with a lot of data. And if we had to process that on CPUs, it would take in the order of weeks. And you know, we, that, that isn't feasible for us. So by using NVIDIA GPUs and CUDA in particular, um, that allows us to um, bring that down to a matter of hours. Just as in 2D video, CUDA helps a lot with doing the compression. It's helping us a lot with being able to compress this volumetric video. We're all about making the like, most realistic humans possible in VR. And we're looking at ways to use deep learning to sort of improve that reconstruction quality, whether that's the depth estimation or the colouring, all these components that make, um, make our humans look the best they can. We want to be able to uh, enable content creators to be able to use our technology to create their own content and um, make that as easy as possible for people.